Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Millman Family. We are here with Derek and Cheryl and Dink, our little kitty kitty. And uh, Derek is actually climbing out of bed. Um, I was over watching uh, the kids go all go to school, and then there was a Showtime singer out there, so while he was sleeping, and I was waiting to get ready to start recording. I was over there listening to her sing, and then she got too hungry, and then she left, and... And that was the end of that. So, um, I was very, very busy while well, you guys were not even knowing I was busy. Anyways, um, so I've come to a conclusion on what I want to do for the house. Um, someone had mentioned, uh, roll for it. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Hold on. Let's go with Derek and do this. We can talk about houses later. <laughs> we gotta worry about the fire. Fire, 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 fire! Derek. <laughs> I was gonna say Derek. Let's go. Um. Ah, oh, this drives me nuts. Anyways. Ahem. I was hoping it was that house. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys. We're gonna be here forever. Nah, not really. Oh, look, you can see downtown. I can't wait until this is actually filled. It's not going to be all houses out here. There's going to be a lot of other stuff out here, too. So it's not just like, you know, these people are going to be living in these houses and in the dirt forever. I want to put more of those brambly things. I like those. They kind of look cool. Anyways, let's jump on down in here. Oh, my goodness. Some crazy stuff's happening. Who's this? Laron? Oh, I miss Laron. <laughs> you guys watch my, um... 24 Little Sims LP, you'll understand why. But anyways, in this one, we hate him. So, <sighs> it's okay. Why don't you be friendly? Why don't you go ahead and... No, don't be friendly. Never mind. What are you going to do? No, you're not. Oh my goodness, you're the hor most horrible person in the world. All right, well, since he's already pretty much taken care of his fire... I'm going to have him come over here and visit this lot so he can work on his fire truck and so we can get him something to eat as well. So let's go ahead and let him visit over there. Please tell me you're going to take this. <laughs> oh, okay. Good. I was going to say, please tell me you're going to take it so I don't have to worry about it. And then he did it. He was such a good boy. Anyways, so I'm really liking that Mako's coming together. I like that we've got this little restaurant over here. And we've got our... Uh, one tower building. That's actually going to be the... Well, you'll find out. <laughs> I'm sure you guys can kind of figure out what I'm going for here. This is like, you know, the downtown area. I guess it really doesn't matter <laughs> if you guys know or not. I li really like that house. I'm really jealous that we didn't get it. Oh, wait. You are a firefighter and you're over here playing chess. Okay. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Um, excuse me. Oh, I was like, where did you get a baby from? Because I thought that was him. Oh, boy, that was scary and a half. All right. Let's get you over here. I want you to go ahead and buy some food because you are starving. You are starving it up. All right. There should be some things. Oh, no, this is the saunas because it's fall. Oh, 10 days until winter. Man, I better get the winter festival going. I was trying to figure out this one. I don't think I got it fixed, so that really stinks. All right, you handled the emergency. Emergency, emergency. I don't think, um, what I think I'm going to do is I'll probably just let the track sit here. Well, actually, I had to replace all the tracks, so I don't know how it works. If you don't replace it, I don't think it's going to be there. But I think that's why it's having that big issue. So what I might do is just delete it. Or just leave the track. I don't know. I don't know. I may not choose to have this be the festival much longer. I may choose for it just to be a park or something and just, you know, let it stay on the, like, summer one. I'm not really sure. Anyways, so he needs something to eat. So we're going to go ahead and get him some hot wings. No, get hot dogs because it's your favorite item. So you might as well get it. Even knowing we could make it at home and you can't make hot wings at home, you might as well just get it. Whoa, we're spinning around like crazy people. All right, so let's go ahead and let you eat this. 
and then you'll be oh, good for good needs, job. and then I'm going to let you go over and take care of your truck. Where's your truck at? I think that's it right there. Nope. <laughs> that's not it. <laughs> it's over here. Uh, no, Cheryl would not like to go on a date with you. That's it right there. <laughs> We're looking through this. This is pretty bad. All right, go ahead and maintain your fire engine, and then you should be good. All right, perfect. Your job performance is, like, to the max. To the maximum. All right. You could buy food, but where'd the person go? Um, where's this man going? I have no idea. I'm gonna watch because I want to know where he's going. What will happen is if I decide to take out the track, the um, roller coaster, <clears throat> the fence will still be here. So they'll still have to enter the same exact way. They just, it, the track won't be going around it. So it kind of won't make as much sense. But what I could do instead is, you know, um, just leave it open and just let there be nothing there for that except for summer. Because I really don't think you can even use this. So I don't know. We'll have to see. These guys going to try it? See, if I test for a valid track, the rest of it doesn't light up, so I don't know why, but it really should. I don't know. I don't really get it at all. Anyways, so I don't know if maybe it's having an issue because I've got two different sets of roller coasters on here or not, but it's really driving me nuts that it's not working. So I may just delete it and just keep the one for summer and do something else. I could po probably put uh, these little stilts still there and just take the track off. And what I could put there instead is maybe some place where they could just walk around and put some things up there that they could do, like telescopes and things. I could do that. Oh, Shiro, you're cute. You got like little curly hair. Look how curly it is. Oh, look at this puppy douche. We're going to totally get animals, so don't worry. <laughs> We're totally doing it up. More animals than we have now. We're going to get horses. We are going to get dogs and cats and birds and lizards and snakes and rodents and turtles and fish and everything we're gonna do it all all right so why don't you go ahead and improve the horsepower on this as well while you're right here and you're in a great mood um i feel bad making him work even knowing hits after his hours look how frigged up that road is over there it looks ridiculous um but uh yeah anyways You've seen it work, though, so it's not really that big of a deal to me that it's, like, messed up. If you guys aren't ever going to use this world and it's just going to be me, I'm probably never going to fix all the issues that are with this world, <laughs> which is so bad because I should because people will probably download it. But um, as of right now, there is no process of fixing the world at this moment because the whole thing is... <laughs> is if I were to go in and fix it, I would have to take all these lots and replace them again. Uh, didn't you bring a baby with you? Yeah, I think you did. Where's your baby at? <laughs> Missing. You got rid of her. <clears throat> Anyways, I don't know what this man is doing, but uh, he really should probably go back to work. I just, I don't get why it doesn't work. I really wish I understood it because this isn't right it should be valid throughout the whole thing but it's not what I want to do is when I go when I get back to the summer one I want to try and test for the valid track like I just did with that one and see if the whole thing lights up or if it's just this piece that lights up because the other in the summertime they could ride it because we went on it um, so I don't know if it's just this one or what is going on but it really drives me nuts so El nutso if I click on this, so yeah, see, because I can't choose for a va to check for a valid track. I can only do it from here. So I don't know how you could do that. I may be able to look it up maybe online and see what's going on there, too. What is this? 
Oh my goodness, look at the little doggy doodles. When you're done, you should totally feed that dog a treat because he's hungry. You know, I just, I feel bad for dogs that are hungry and they're out in town. Especially because I know where these people live, pretty much. And they're like, way over there. And that's the school, I think. Nope, subway station. How is that the subway station? I'm confused. So then what's that? The bookstore? Yeah, I thought that was our home. I guess our home is over there. So far, we can't even see it. That's crazy. That's crazy docks. All right. So there's no more food available here. Shucks. What happened over here? Oh, boy. I did not mean to do that. I don't know how that happened. All right. This thing, I swear, it's been here for a long time. So what I'm going to do is so it doesn't lag my game. There's no one in it, as you can see. Nobody's in there. See? Nobody. It's just kind of stuck here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn my testing cheats on and I'm going to delete it. Alright. That way it doesn't lag my game down. I've noticed that with Island Paradise too. If you guys are having issues, I talked about this on my current household video. But if you guys are current, having issues with um, Island Paradise, um, Isla Paradiso in particular, uh, lagging, try to looking at the waters. A lot of times when mine lags a lot, it's because of all the boats that are on the water that no one's using. They're just kind of sitting there because the people got out of the boats, probably like went snorkeling or swimming or something or did something and um, they left their boats on the water and then they're just sitting there so they're, the game has to constantly render those those um, vehicles on the water. So if you guys have the issue, try it. It may not be a complete fix, but it may help. I noticed that it helped mine when I was playing. I mentioned it in my game. I said that, you know, it was working better since I did it. And uh, so, yeah, that's what I did to uh, help my lag in Isla Paradiso. Is that totally a limo? I think it is. Look at that taxi fly. Okay, seriously, it's taking you this long to do this. Phew! Okay, the dog is gone too, by the way, so you can't feed him a treat. Okay, so is it done? Everything's done with it? Go home. Alright, so good. We've got that taken care of. Now we probably got to maintain the engine when we get home. Not going to lie to you. But now that we've got this improved to the third horsepower, we've got it all fixed up. Yeah, this is the road that's messed up right here. You can see it. It's messed up. Anyways, um, now that we've also got it improved so it's maintained and everything like that, it actually goes a lot, lot faster. So we're on speed one. It would look, it seems like we're on like speed three, but we're not. We're on speed one. So that's good because we don't want to be like <clears throat> slow to our fires and things. Anyways. All right. Coming on in here, let's go ahead and let you use the bathroom. And I'm going to let you wash your hands afterwards. And then let's see. What else do you need to do? After that, let's get you outside. You're going to go ahead and recycle this. Go ahead and... Why don't you pay the bills for 84 simoleons and get the mail. And then what I'm going to let you do is I'm going to go ahead and let you eat some... Oh, there's no dinner. All right, serve up some dinner. Do some spaghetti. And then we should be good from there. I'm guessing she's sleeping. Yeah, she's sitting up here sleeping. Or laying up here sleeping, I mean. All right, Dink, what do you need? You need the bathroom. So why don't you go over here and actually use the bathroom? What do you mean there's no interactions available? There's plenty of interactions available. All right, use bathroom, scratch. Then you need to eat. And then I'm going to get Derek to give you some attention before he goes to bed because your social is more than half down and we don't really need you to be like, you know, sad. All right, so tomorrow or today is Friday in this game. 
All right. Okay, Derek. I can hear someone else's music too. It's these guys. And she's got music on too. <laughs> We're all popping it with our music. <gasps> too funny. Alright, so you're enjoying the music? Well, I'm glad you're enjoying the music. What kind do you like? Hip hop? Why don't we change it to hip hop for you? Uh, oh, it is on hip hop. Who am I getting? I don't think that's what Cheryl likes, though. I think she likes something else. I can't wait until they get married so I can actually control her. I don't want to waste too much of her time, but I wanted him to like finish his lifetime wish before they got married and had kids, but it's taking way too long. And I think it's because there isn't a lot of houses, so we don't really get like the earthquakes and all that kind of stuff. But at least we've got five of the 30. I mean, we could be still at zero, so. It just sucks because normally when they get to like level 10, oh, well, I'm talking about when you're in like a normal like EA town. Normally when they get to like level 10, um, they get a lot of like large house fires where you have to save people. I haven't gotten like barely anything in this. Crazy. Alright. I can't even hear that song. It must be, like, really quiet. Mm. Abram, you're up to Hania skill level 10. And, yeah, we would need to maintain that. But, do I want to do it tonight or do I want to wait and do it tomorrow? Because I still want him to give the cat attention. And I also want him to clean this up. So, let's see. Um, feed the cat a treat. Let him sniff your hand. Talk to him. Alright, you're not going to need to clean up then. Ow, my cats do this all the time and it really drives me nuts. That is really loud and it's next door. <laughs> it's freaking crazy. Alright, have fun. Reinforce. Praise for being non-destructive. Alright, that is just too much. Let's see. I think. No, not that. I think if you go in here to Master Controller and you click open, I can see into their house. Let me see. Turn this off. Oh, and also I want to turn it to low. We'll turn it on for a second. Change it to. No, no I don't care what it's on. Just change it to low. And do the same thing with this one. This is why this is a good mod to have sometimes. Right. Change it to low. Turn it off. And then all you just do to not be able to see in their house again is you just click close. And then you won't see in their house. And you do the same thing over here. Click close. And when you go back over, you can't actually go into their house again. So that should be good. It's my little fix to getting rid of that music that is way too loud for you to be able to hear. <laughs> hear your own thoughts. Alright, so you're going to praise the cat. And then hopefully the cat will go to bed on his own. Oh, you're up? Okay. Boy, Stoopy. Give me a Alright, so when you get all those done, let me get you upstairs, get you to bed. Just remember to close the houses if you do that. Remember to close them because it'll lag your game as well. Because it'll be too much to load. You'll be loading all of those items at once. So, always remember to close it up, back up if you do it. Unless you're going to use it, you know, quite frequently, you're going to go over to that house quite frequently and you want to just be able to see what's going on in there. Like if it was like your kid or something that had moved out, that's totally different. Oh boy, Derek. 
All right, let's see. He's taking an awfully long time to play with this cat, isn't he? I think he's taking a sweet time. He's like, I don't want to go to bed. Not yet. <laughs> Not right now. <gasps> Having too much fun. Yeah, well, Derek. I've got work tomorrow. Lady, why don't you take a shower? I wish you would. I really do. Alright, cat. Why don't you go to sleep? That way I don't have to worry about either of you. And I can just worry about... Uh, Derek getting a full night's rest and you not waking him up constantly. Alright, well since the two people that I can control, which is Derek and the cat, are both going to bed, I'm going to go ahead and cut out here and I'll be back when one of them is getting up for their day. Be back in just a second. Okay, so Derek's getting up right now out of bed. And uh, the cat's up, but uh, he's just taking care of his needs that I told him he needs to take care of. Cheryl, seriously? You're going to take the toilet from us? I'm going to smack you, lady. Alright, alright, alright. She's done with it. Clean. Take a shower. Clean. Yeah, about that. And then you might as well make your bed because she never does anything. Will you stop brushing your stupid teeth and at least take a darn shower? Like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> Why won't you take a shower? What the hell? I may have to reset her because it's really bugging me that she won't take a shower. I don't know why. It's just weird. It's really weird. Really, 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 really weird. Alright, don't take your shower. I'm going to have you go ahead and do a risky woohoo with Cheryl. That's going to be your little fondue. Oh yeah, I forgot we had all these photos, by the way. Oh, they're so cute together. Look at them. That one, you can't really see anything. That's really cute. That's cute, too. <laughs> and this one's funny. I like these funny ones. This one's kind of funny because it's, like, behind it. But I really like that photo of him and that one. Um, off of hers, she's got three of the same. I don't really like hers very much. I do want to change her outfit, but, you know. Uh, that looks a little weird. You're not even looking at it. But okay. Ugh. Yeah, you freaking stink. This is how we're going to get her to take a shower. Ugh. I'm not even lying to you. That is how we're going to get her to take a shower. We're going to woohoo with her in the shower. And we're going to possibly get a little baby on the way. I don't know if she's like, you know, got one coming or not. I don't think so. Because I haven't seen her been getting sick a lot. I got just the cat down here while he was playing with this. He got a wish to go to uh, the beach. I locked it in. Oh, yeah, and Derek has to upgrade the stereo and return it to Laron. It was one of the opportunities he got, so I locked that in. <laughs> That's too funny because they're like nemesis. <laughs> All right. Ooh, I just got the hiccups. <laughs> good job on waiting, Derek. You're a good man. All right, I do want to get her looks changed, though. And I think I want to change out his um, his looks as well, maybe. I'm not really sure. Maybe his clothes, at least. He's so buff, though. It's so hard to do anything with him. Woo! <laughs> That makes me laugh. Alright, let me get you over here to eat the grape pancakes. Um, no, you don't. You can get down. Thank you. He was like, oh god, Derek's coming. <laughs> and then jumped back down. <laughs> it's too funny. Now he's trying to get into the bathroom and can't because Derek's standing in front of the door. Derek, this house is not big enough for you to be running around like a crazy person. The things are still falling. Oh my goodness. Finally, she's clean. It's about like day one of 5,000 that she finally got cleaned. Anyways, Derek, clean that up when you're done, please. And it told me my engine was wearing out. How the heck? That is not even possible. I totally just fixed that engine up yesterday. 
Oh yeah, you got a guitar. I totally forgot. You also want to make a stink juice potion, and I want you to do that. I really do. So let's see. What do you need, cat? Social. Why don't you come over here and talk with Cheryl? Oh, you're going to do it on your own. I'm not going to tell you what to do then. Fine. You do it on your own little time. Uh, Laron and Angie. Powers. They continue to long for a home of their own, but have failed to locate one. I just added a new apartment building in. You guys can't move into one of those apartments. Then I got a problem. You got a problem. Not me. <laughs> I've got a problem. No, you've got a problem. <laughs> I'll argue with myself and who's got the problem. Oh, boy. They sure make a lovely couple. They can be inseparable. All right. Well, that's fine. All right. And Dink, you're good otherwise. You do not need to use the potty again. Why don't you go ahead and play with this? There. That'll get you working on something that's educational. I don't know. Probably not educational for you at all. Why don't you discover a potion and why don't you hurry the frig up? Alright. Ooh, it's a large house fire. Where'd it go? <laughs> I guess it didn't want us to do that one. Oh, come on. Someone already put it out. Must be. Alright, maintain. Uh, I just exited all that stuff out for nothing. <laughs> I'll get angry. <sighs> She's hungry. Then eat. There's food in there. You're going to eat pancakes at 5 o'clock of that night. Okay. Sounds good to me. Alright, seriously ignore that stupid call. But you probably will answer it, so whatever. Are you going to finish this up anytime soon? I'm getting bored of watching you fix an alarm. And your truck should be fine. I don't know why it told me it's wearing out. Because it shouldn't be. Alright. Perfect. And then let me pull out that stereo. Out of our family inventory. Let's see. It's in here. Oh wow. Look at all the stuff we got. I totally forgot we had all this in here. I'm not even lying to you. All right, it's got to be one of these little mother pearls. So, <laughs> so we're going to do that. We should totally put this out. <laughs> Where? I don't know. This is why we need a bigger house. So we can do this stuff. <laughs> we can't even put a darned coffee table out. <laughs> that is bad. That is bad. All right. Derek, recycle that and I will feel good. Oh, yeah, we were going to carve pumpkins too. There's only 10 days left. Here, Cheryl, why don't you carve a pumpkin? Do it up. Do it up. <laughs> Sitting on the floor waiting for you. Hope you're going to do it. She probably won't. Oh, well, maybe she will. Nope. <laughs> She's going to play stupid games. She always plays stupid games. Who am I, who am I kidding? All right, if you could make a stink juice potion, that would make my life much better. Because then we could go and repair the computer and get the 250 for that, too. <sighs> Which I know you can do. I know you could do both, actually. All right, and you need to, you know, just to make his life miserable, we're going to do wire the house of speakers for this because when it's on, they won't even be able to sleep. It'll keep, and if someone keeps turning it on, it'll keep waking them up, so it's going to make his life miserable. And since we don't like him, why would I give him a nice upgrade? Exactly. Wouldn't. Oh, boy. Don't do this while you're singed. Are you freaking crazy? You're crazy. Why don't you come up here? Do you need to pee? Yes, you do. Use and shower. Blumma, blumma, blumma. <laughs> That's all I hear. All right, and then we're going to let you carve a jack-o'-lantern. Why don't you do evil? Because I think you're, in, you're evil. Yeah, so. Do the evilness. Do the evilness pumpkin. I thought she would do one. Let me give it to her. Maybe she'll do it on her own. Cheryl, carve some pumpkins. All right. Fiddlesticks. <laughs> I love that word. Oh, that's a quick shower. <laughs> I guess she must not have been too dirty. You were just uh, singed. Must be. All right. Is the cat taking care of his needs? You want to play? You want to chase Garrett? <sighs> yeah, he's taking care of his needs. All right. Do this pumpkin up. Do it good. Don't mess it up. If you do, we got another one, so don't worry. 
I hate that they put it on the carpet. Like, ugh. Put it on the paper. <laughs> That's totally me. I'd be like, oh my god. Like, you totally ruined my carpet. I get mad at my cats. And they, like, get dirt on the carpet. So I'll be like, you ruined my carpet! <laughs> no, I'm not really that mean. Alright, is it working? I don't know. You want to visit the beach. There's no beach on this side of the island. That's a bad thing. Alright, we're getting closer. Must be. I think that's messed up. Maybe not. Kind of looks messed up to me a little bit. No, it doesn't. It's fine. It's fine. He did fine. Ooh. Evilness. Alright. We're going to take this. We're going to pull it outside. Right. Here. And we're going to take it and we're going to light her up. Woo! <laughs> 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 He's all excited about his lit up evil pumpkin. Look at this stem on it. They make it like pointy or something. I don't know. Or maybe it's just like that normally. But it looks funny. <laughs> looks like his hair. <laughs> wow, we just got a nice shot up Derek's butt. <laughs> Alright. Are these kids the, or people outside? No. And they're not even home. So it's not even like you could go. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Go scratch on the door. Alright, let's see. Oh, just memory. Just someone else's memory. Alright, could you hurry this up a little bit? You do take forever on this stuff, kind of stuff, don't you? Forgot. And then when you're done, you don't know stink. Yeah, he doesn't know the stink juice. Alright, so. Oh, you're loved. Um. You want to hiss at her, and you want to chase him, but they're not even here. Cat, stop it. Get down. Go here. Oh, their toilet is broken. That is nasty. Go sniff this guy's hand. All right, come on. Are you ready? He's like, yeah, right. That's taking too long. I hear you there taking way too long and then go eat some spaghetti you're fiendishly delighted from watching a sim suffer that's horrible that is horrible and he's over there sleeping on the bed oh boy cat oh billy was silly oh you wanted to uh, hiss at her whoops that's not the one I went to click Oh. okay he's actually doing his homework for like five seconds not sure you got it all done, but that's okay. Okay, random. <laughs> Is this what we spend our time doing? Turn on, turn off, turn on, turn off, turn on, turn off. <laughs> oh, I thought he turned it off and I was going to laugh again, but... <laughs> He's actually watching TV. And the cat is over here <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> He's freaking lost his mind. Are you done with this stupid thing yet? Man, taking you way too long to do this. Alright, are you done? Ha ha! We got her done. Alright. Oh, he's still using it. Okay. Sorry. Didn't mean to click it too quick. I didn't mean to click it so quickly. Alright, so let's see. He's excited because he upgraded to stereo. Yo, yo, yo. Alright, so let's put this in our inventories. And then we'll have to go deliver that um, after he eats, maybe. Or we could do it tomorrow since, you know, he doesn't have to work. So, Wait, it still says upgrade the stereo and return it to Laron. Did we upgrade the wrong one? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <sighs> Seriously? We totally upgraded one of these already. Which one did we upgrade? Kick. 
How are you gonna kick the stereo? No. We must have upgraded the wrong one. Oh boy. Put this in here. Must be you have to do this one. Upgrade to wire the house with speakers. Alright, cat. Oh, you're gonna do your homework too? Look at you go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did he do it? Oh, oh the radical repair on potion. Alright, fine. Fine. Alright, before you do this, you better pee. Why don't you go ahead and use and wash your hands. And then do this. And then if you didn't do this, clean this up. And then you can do this. Alright. Cat. Get up. She's here. Um. Can you please get off the bed, too? Come on! You take too long! Dang! Time you actually get done with this, she's gonna be like gone. By the way, she's an elder. If you guys didn't couldn't tell. I don't know how you want to hit his at her when you can't even do these interactions. Lady, you're driving me nuts. Can we just do this, please? Cheryl over there playing video games, making a lot of noise. I don't know why you can't hiss at her. Alright, you people are crazy. Suck on that one, people. Oh, everyone's visible. Everyone went invisible. Alright, there we go. Go ahead and... Hiss at her. Now get that wish done. Alright, there we go. Alright, come back over here. Let's get you to eat. No. Eat. Use. Scratch. And then you're good otherwise. Alright, Derek, you're too tired to continue. So why don't you go ahead and just clean up your plate and go to bed. You started. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. All right, and what do you want to make now? A radical repair on potion. You already know that. Uh, light this mother up. Why are you turning it out? I don't think they say lit very long, which is really annoying. So I think tomorrow we're going to go to the beach. Um. Uh, the beach is on the total other side of the island. It's a full beach. It's a full length beach on the whole other side there is this water in the middle here too it's kind of like a lake kind of I guess I don't really have a beach there but I do want to kind of put one there but I don't know I'll have to figure it out uh, anyway so while Derek's sleeping let me go ahead and cut out here and I will be back in just a bit when he's getting up for his day okay so Dink actually woke them up but whatever um it's not that nice of a day, and I do want to go over to the beach, so I'm hoping that it's going to clear up in a little bit so we can head on over in just a little bit. Once he kind of finished taking care of himself, I'm going to go ahead and let him do that. If he's tired, there's things over there that can help him, so I'm not going to worry about it. All right, and she's going to go to the bathroom down here. Sounds good to me. We had to clean it. It was disgusting. Um, anyway, so we're going to take Cheryl out with us and we're going to take Dink because he wants to go to the beach. So I figured that would be an easy way to get him to the beach if he wanted to go. Alright, so let's just get you downstairs. Let's get you fed and then I'll go ahead and let you guys uh, head on over. 
And I think they'll really like what's over there. I think they'll have some fun. So let's go ahead and get this done. And then what are you making? There's food in there. Oh, she makes me crazy. Guys, <laughs> you gotta walk around each other. Cheryl, move. Go here. All right. I don't know why she decided to make freaking waffles when she could have just had what was in the fridge, but whatever. All right, when you're done, I guess until your wife is, or your, not your wife, your girlfriend is ready to go, we're going to let you work on this. I'm happy he doesn't work today, to be honest. All right, and there's five days until spooky day. Sounds good to me. That stupid computer. <laughs> stupid computer. I love how he is fully rested, but he wakes them up when they're like barely rested at all. Oh, makes me angry. Anyways, I was going to have him go back to bed and then I was like, oh, I already set him up to do all this stuff. I'm not going to worry about it. Wait, before you do that, you need to uh, clean that up. Cheryl, don't burn the house down, first of all. Second of all, hurry this up because we're ready to go. We're ready to go. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Well then, stupid fill the ball. Oh my goodness. Maybe it's telling us we should. Oh my goodness. What is going on out there? We got some scary uh, stuff happening outside. Alright, well then while you're waiting, why don't you take a nap? There you go. So waiting for her to finish up whatever she's doing. I don't even know. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You burnt it. Now you're going to not eat it. Oh, she's finally up to cooking skill level 3. Oh, that's noisy enough where it woke you up. You're kidding me. We'll take you out. We want the house clean before we leave, though. Why don't you just eat what's in the fridge? You could have done that 50 years ago. And we could have been already out of here. <sighs> not gonna go there. I'm not gonna go there. I'm not gonna go there. I'm not gonna go there. <laughs> Getting angry. Uh, yeah. All right. Why don't you ask her out on a date when you're done too? We can make this official. An official date, CEO. I'm guessing this is the um, thing that we have to do. Is it still raining? No, it's not raining anymore. Okay, it's hailing. <laughs> no, it's not raining. It's hailing. Alright, so then after you ask her on a date, go ahead and clean that up for her, and then we'll head out. She just couldn't clean it herself. Cat, you really don't need to be using that, but okay. See, he wants to go to the beach. He wants to visit the beach. Visit the beach. And I figured we could get this out of the way when we're over there. I don't think we can do this, but we can, we can look into it. We can look into the situations. All right, so now that we're ready to go, let's head on over to the beach, which is well, way over here on the other side of the world. On the other side of the world, which is right here. This is the slot with your date. Now, I am going to tell you I just went over here and built this lot because it was not oh, built. <sighs> you guys always have such a hard time figuring this out, don't you? Fine. You know what we'll do? I'm going to take you here. How can I take the cat with us? I don't think we can be on a date if we do this. So go ahead and end the date for quickly. Go here with Cheryl and Dink. How about that? Can you do that? You can't do that either. Oh my goodness. Why can you not? I don't understand why you guys can't do that. Why you can't get there. Alright, fine. What about, can you go up here? Are you going to allow that me to, are you going to do this one? Well, it seems like he's coming because he's actually in the truck. 
I'm hoping everyone's on their way. Well, you're in there. You're in there, so we're good. All right, so when they get over here, hopefully I can get them to go over to the beach. We're probably not going to get to spend much time at the beach, but we're going to get over there so I can show it to you guys, and then I'll go ahead and end the episode. But like I said, I did just build this like while they were sleeping. I built it because it wasn't built. The lot was placed. The, the lot wasn't actually built, so that's what we're kind of going through here. All right, are you going to get over here? Man, you guys take forever. All right, here they come. Here they come. All right, now the beach is just right over here. So can you go here with these guys? I think it's because they don't understand how to get there, maybe. Can you do it? Can you do it? Yeah, I don't really know why they can't figure out how to get to the beach, because, I mean, we are, where are you at? Why are you way over there? Alright, stop, 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 stop. It's going to take the cat way too long to get way over here, so cat, where did you get knocked out of? Alright, stop. Why is the cat, like, 50,000 years away? Yeah, why is he way over here? I'm really confused. I am really confused. Okay, does that knock you guys out? There we go. Alright, I don't know how the cat... I'm just going to teleport the cat over. I'm not even going to lie to you. Alright, why don't you just go here with Cheryl. See if you can get that done. And then I'll teleport the cat over, because that's just mean to make him run all that way. That'll be, he'll be there forever. I love his umbrella. <laughs> I think she has one. I can't remember. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop. Go here with Cheryl. What is he doing? <laughs> oh my goodness, this is just annoying. It's just, it gets on my nerves because it's they're doing it. And this is really slow. Slow process. Right. Can you do that? Yeah, now I did it. Alright, good. Alright, so we're going to have him run on over here. Let's see, can you do it? Please tell me you can do it. Alright, here they come. Alright, so this is my beach. It's got a lot of debris on it. I know. Um, I was trying to make it look like it's not like one of the richer beaches, like the cleaner ones. So that's what I was trying to go for. It's got like the, you know, the multiple different things on it. Anyway, so over here you've got your three lifeguard seats, which you could obviously now join the lifeguard career, and you couldn't do that before, so it'll probably spawn a couple people for that job. Alright, anyway, so while they're on their way, let me teleport the cat over, because that's just so very mean that he didn't get to come. Uh, I did put out some lounging chairs here on the beach, but I figured not too many, because normally I would do a lot, but if they can relax on the ground or play in the sand here, I might as well just let them do that instead. Over here, I did put this underneath a roof, which I did some pretty colored roofs. Um, the reason I did that is so they could sit under here, not get soaking wet, and be able to eat in peace. And, you know, if it were hot out, the sun wouldn't be beaming right on them. Not that I think it really matters in The Sims, because it doesn't matter if you're outside, you still get hot. Anyway, so I put some trash cans, and I put a couple of grills over here with a couple of picnic tables, just so they could sit out and eat. Um, I did put the palm trees in. This is kind of where I figured the front of the lot would be. Maybe that's the issue. Is that the issue? Uh, I might have to maybe set the front of the lot. Anyway, so the lifeguard seats are actually underneath a little roof as well. So when they're sitting on those chairs, they're not going to get wet. Uh, I did that because in 
Isla Paradiso, a lot of the times they're not sitting on the chairs. They're surveying the beach by running up and down it. And they get soaking wet and it's that really bad moodlet. So they could actually sit here. They could survey the beach if they wanted to and they'd be good. Over here I put a water slide in. I just figured, you know what, I might as well use the water slide while I can. And since this is a beach, it's probably some place you'd want to have a water slide. You'd be pretty hot other than, you know, going into the ocean. Over here, I did put in this little toddler area so that, you know, if you brought your toddlers over on a really nice day, they could sit in here. Not that I'm saying that they absolutely should bring them over here, but, you know, a lot of people do. Um, I did put in the little uh, gingerbread ha uh, ones from the Katy Sw Perry Sweet Treats just because they're very colorful compared to all the other swing sets, I feel. Um, I may switch it out and change up the colors or something because I'm not really set on the color scheme, but um, I just thought the candy thing was kind of cool with with the colors of the buildings and all that so I put in the slide the little house that they could climb on and a swing just so they could sit and you know have some fun the kids could um, I did put in some nice flowers in front of the bathrooms and I put in another set of three chairs over here that they can lounge on inside of the actual bathrooms in here I did put in the little fans the uh, I don't know. They came from the sensory store anyways. I put in some changing tables for the people who do bring their kids over. And there is also little potties in here so you could train uh, the babies. Also, the urinals, how you would tell the difference between them. The doors are pretty colored like the outside of the building. And they do have their bathrooms and their sinks to wash their hands. Um, I didn't put mirrors in because I figured you wouldn't be spending much time in the bathroom. You'd want to pretty much be out here, you know, on this glorious beach uh, having some fun. I did put in this boat over here. I kind of thought it was pretty cool looking coming off of the edge of the land and into the water. kind of looked really cool like it actually had shipwrecked. What the heck? That's weird. Um, anyways, so that is the beach, and it's not a huge lot, but it I thought it gave them something to do. It opens up opportunities for more jobs as well. Um, the beach isn't very big. That's the bad thing. And I hate that you can actually see the, gr the water or the ground underneath the water. Anyways, we're not going to focus on that. I'm not the best at building worlds. I'm not going to lie to you. But why don't you, um, why don't you go lounge here? See if you can do that. A lot of times my sims can't actually get into the water here. I don't know what the issue is, but we're going to see. Wow, up to your knees in the water and you're <laughs> and you haven't even switched in your bathing suit. It's too funny. Cheryl will do what she wants. I don't really know what she wants to do, so she can kind of do her own thing. Unless she's going home. Maybe not. All right, Dink, did you get rid of that? Yeah, you got rid of that. I could have put things out for the cats and things to do, but I wasn't going to do that. All right, so go ahead and lounge in your little lounger. All right, and as you can see, this is the color of his loungers. I'm just going to go ahead and let him nap on it a couple of times. That way, you know, he gets to have some fun. Um, I thought this was a nice little touch. They could lounge on the ocean. It looks like, you know, the ocean's really big, but it's really not. Um, and also, I think they can snorkel here. Yeah, they can. They can snorkel. I didn't add in any um, dive lots, but I want to. I want to do it in that part over there because that part's a lot bigger than over here. Um, because the edge of the the water is like right here so you can kind of see it all the way down um, so it doesn't if you look back like from here this is about as much of the ocean that there is but this much ocean all the way down is a lot so I mean they could swim for days <laughs> I, I promise you um, so that was kind of what I was thinking um, can the cat swim no he could drink it though I wish the cat could swim I wish the cat could swim in the ocean that would be cute anyway so that's kind of what I've done for the beach. I added in that little poster, too, of the swimming thing. I thought that was quite fitting. Um, so, yeah, they could eat over here. They could use the bathrooms. They can get sleep. Well, that scared the bejesus out of me. What is going on? Is she pregnant? Please tell me she's pregnant. Oh, <gasps> she's pregnant! Yay! <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh my goodness, I didn't have a clue. Oh my goodness, that is so exciting. Where's she going? <laughs> Where are you going? All right, so, oh my goodness, I'm so excited now. All right, so I guess we're going to be having a baby. Oh my gosh, yay. Um, all right, so she just found out that she's pregnant. 
Um, so yeah, I had no idea. I hadn't seen her get sick or anything and now she's going to get in the ocean. Okay. You can do that. Um, yeah, so I hadn't seen her get sick or anything. So I had no idea. So that was just a shock and a half to me. But, um, yeah, I'm really excited. And I'm really excited they're actually getting in the ocean because that's kind of the reason I brought them over here. All right, so why don't you go ahead and lounge, and then I'm going to let you nap again. I don't know what she's going to do. Don't drown. Please don't drown. All right, so I'm going to let him just nap a couple more times. Anyways, guys, so this is where I'll go ahead and end the episode here. In the next one, hopefully the baby will be here. We'll get to see if it's going to be a boy or a girl. I've already got names picked for all the kids that they're going to have. So please don't send me names quite yet. We will be needing names in the future. But um, yeah, anyways, if you guys like this, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. Tell me if you guys are excited about the first baby coming into this LP or if you're not as excited as I am. <laughs> anyways, guys, so I will talk to you guys in the next one. Thanks so very much for watching.